A drop in participation and donations has Little Rock's Susan G. Coleman chapter saying goodbye to the race for the cure. But don't worry, they hope a new event will ramp up the giving so they can fulfill their promise to patients. KRK 4's Hillary Hunt is in the studio with the details. Hillary? I promise something so important to them, guys. Representatives with Coleman, Arkansas, tell me this year, sadly, they couldn't follow through with their grant amounts that they've issued in years past. They said it's really disappointing, but they have some good news. They say it's out with the race for the cure and in with the more than pink walk. This is a cause that should never go away and it won't. Mary Parham calls it the fight of her life. It's a journey that you that will enlighten you. Tuesday, she sat down with us before she headed to her chemo treatment. Parham was diagnosed with breast cancer last year, and she tells me she's found strength in the support of Coman, Arkansas. We see you had a, a, a bill that didn't go through your insurance. We'll be glad to do a grant for you. A lot of that grant money raised through this Little Rock's Race for the Cure. This past year, we were asked for $1.7 million in legitimate grant requests from every corner of the state, but we were only able to give away about $700,000. Amy Treadway serves as Komen, Arkansas's executive director. She says the race plays a huge role in raising that money. This chart shows in 2008, more than 45,000 paid to participate. In 2018, only a little more than 11,000. That's about a 75% drop, sparking a change. It's out with the race for the cure and in with the more than pink walk. We're hoping that with this walk and a resurgence about Susan G. Komen and what it is that Susan G. Komen does, that people will have a, a renewed interest. It's women like Parham who benefit directly from your feet hitting the pavement and of course your donations. And she wants to see you there on October 26. Everybody can get involved. Mom, dad, grandparents, the dog, the cat, you know, dress up everybody. She wants everyone to come out. That walk is actually going to be moved to the river market this year, so something different, and you're only allowed in the area if you have paid to register so that they can raise those funds. Ashley?